Hey guys, today I want to share with you those three important books that helped me achieve a rank 2 for my MDS entrance examination. Well, I don't want to waste any further time. Let's go ahead and see that. Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. I'm Dr. Noor Saira, an endodontist and a part-time YouTuber. I make videos on exam strategies, productivity habits, productivity lifestyle and exam guidances like those of NEAT MDS. Well, let's not waste further the time and directly jump into the topic of today. That is, what are those three important books that helped me achieve a rank two for my MDS entrance examination? Well, when I entered to prepare for my NEAT MDS, even I was going through the same confusion of which book to pick up and which book not to pick up. A lot of advice from my seniors, from my colleagues, from my friends and my professors and, you know, made me buy a lot of books like those of Sparsh Gupta, Neeraj Vadhavan, Mudit Khanna, Gauri Shankar and of course the Dental Pulse. But eventually I realized that I can only study that much that I will be able to revise and that is the only trick to ace in the examination. And I'm going to go ahead and give you the same advice. Read only that much that you will be able to revise in the end. So going ahead, so the first book is Dental Pulse. Now the Dental Pulse forms the base book. And this is the base minimum that you have to complete to be even eligible for NEAT MDS examination. Now, this is a book which comes in three volumes and the subjects are distributed across the three volumes and the most latest edition being the 14th edition. Now, this book has grown over a period of time. Initially, it just contained a little synopsis and the MCQs, but now it does contain extensive synopsis. A lot of MCQs as well as the recent papers as a different segment itself. So, you don't have to go ahead and search for the recent papers, but it's available right then and there in, in the after the chapters of that specific subject so you can finish your recent mcqs there itself and it's assorted depending upon you know the subject also uh, that's one advantage now second thing about dental pulse is that it is comparatively at a basic level when compared to other books which have a little high funda knowledge and so this forms your basic framework in the mind and uh, it contains synopsis to it which is nothing but the aggregated or condensed information of an entire text you know subject textbook into 20 to 30 pages which basically has the most repeated questions or the potential questions which can be asked but the only problem with the synopsis is that it's given very uh, statement wise or it has doesn't have much explanation it is just you know statements of facts that you have to register into your mind so it becomes a little difficult to study but i have made an entire video on how to read the synopsis the best practices and that you know something which can basically ease your life down so go ahead watch that i will link the video here so this is about the dental pulse now it's very very important to finish dental pulse at least four times before your examination that's how i did it i completed my dental pulse basic four times at least and um, you have to revise dental pulse twice in the last six months that's basic minimum again and how to revise the dental pulse twice in the last six months uh, a complete strategy and a complete schedule i have made it point to point and i have made an entire video on that i have uh, i will link it you can go ahead and watch that as well now this is about dental pulse the second important book that can actually make a difference uh, when compared to somebody who is just doing dental pulse is neeraj vadwan now, Neeraj Vadwan is a little bit of the AIMS level of information. So, what happens with Neeraj Vadwan is the questions are compared to dental pulse a little on the higher level, which means you are increasing the level of information when you are going to Neeraj Vadwan. Okay, so there are a lot of things which are in addition, a little bit on the medical level. But one important thing about Neeraj Vadwan is that they have explained their answers very very well so you don't have to go back to the textbook and search for the answers and the explanation the explanations are given then and there so it's given in a lengthy format so it will be like more of like you're reading the guide so it's a very very beneficial book and, uh, it's a very beneficial book it comes in two volumes and uh, if you're able to cover Neeraj Vadwan with dental pulse and nothing like it okay so this is these are the two books that really helped me and um, 
I understand that a lot of you will be going to coaching and you will have a lot of excess material to study from but you cannot solely solely depend on the coaching so you will have to make your own efforts as well to make a difference between the person uh, to the crowd who is going to the coaching and you because I'm sure there are a lot of people who attend the coaching so you cannot be the same person you have to make a little difference and uh, these are the two books that will uh, make the difference especially Neeraj Vadwan. Neeraj Vadwan has to be done only and only if your dental pulse has been finished at least once which means now you have to go ahead and revise dental pulse that that time you can start you know uh, studying from Neeraj Madhavan one or two pages okay so this was your second book now important thing here that I want to mention is the third book if you are unable to do this third book there is no point of the entire one year efforts trust me when I say this and that third book is basically your notes like I said right in the beginning if you are unable to revise what you have studied throughout the year what you have studied throughout the year is basically a waste because we're just not talking about a recent rank we're talking about a getting a good rank right so what should you do either you make very very effective notes or you follow this one book concept which i have made an entire video on go ahead and watch it i will link it here in brief what is this one book concept you make one base book that will be your dental pulse and whatever extra information you're reading from elsewhere be it your coaching be it your neeraj madhavan jot down the important points stick it into your basic dental pulse and uh, at the end that will be the only book that you revise again i will repeat the statement read only that much that you will be able to revise do not have greed do not read excess and spoil or waste um, your time because ultimately if you are not able to revise that there is no point of doing excessive things so i've spoken in detail about the strategy and how you should do it or how you should write it down everything go ahead and see in that one book concept uh, it's a very important video another important thing that i would want you to go ahead and see is how to make smart notes i will link that a video also here it's very important it's all about uh, how to uh, you know framework how to do mind mapping uh, it's basically to do with active recall techniques how you can you know make your life easy for revision so everything i will link it down so all my videos do have some amount of practical advices small simple tips that can make your life very very easy and it's just not about knowledge it's about how you perform in the examination as well so have a glance of all the videos i am sure you'll pick at least one important point from every video and i hope you like this video as well if you do and you find this helpful please leave a comment in the comment section i hope you have a good day thank you for watching the video and all the best for your examination for more such videos, please like, share, follow and subscribe my YouTube channel. You can also follow me on Instagram. Have a good day. Thank you.